and welcome to this tutorial video on how to search in the globethics.net library, which you can find at https double dot double slash repository dot globethics.net. Search for ethics in higher education as a first example. We click on the magnifier, and here you can see a huge number of results. Some of them might be relevant, listed on top, but many of them may not be. That's why you need to refine or narrow your search. One way to do that is to use quotation marks around your phrase or expression, like this. Now you see the exact phrase or expression in the results, and also that the number of results is much less than without the quotation marks. Another way to refine your search is to use what we call the Boolean operators AND, OR, and NOT. This means you combine certain terms or expressions with these operators. For example, let's combine ethics and higher education with the operator AND, like this. We keep the quotation marks for higher education because we look for this exact expression in combination with ethics. Now, if you want to have more options or results, then use the operator OR. For example, you look for a similar expression that is a synonym for higher education, like tertiary education, and you want either of them present in the results. Then combine them with OR while keeping ethics as the main term with higher education. So this gives the following query, ethics and higher education or tertiary education. You see now that the results contain either of the two expressions mentioned in the search. Now, if you want to exclude a certain term or expression, for example, secondary education, then add the operator NOT, followed by the term or expression you want to exclude, like this. Another way to refine your search is using the option Show Advanced Filters. We click and we see various options. For example, we are interested in a particular author or contributor, such as Obiora Ike, enter his full name in the empty box and click on Apply. We can also add other filters by clicking on this plus sign. Alternatively, we can also use the facets which are displayed on the left hand side of the interface under filter by category. Here, you actually see the same filters such as author contributor, etc., that allows you to look either for a specific author or keyword or your publication or language, etc. Perhaps you are interested in documents with the keyword Africa. Click on it, and this opens a new filter to your query, showing only results with the keyword Africa. Now that we might be satisfied with these results, let's have a closer look at them. Normally, the sort order is by relevance and list view, but you can change that by clicking on the wheel on the right. For example, let us select the sort option Issue Date Descending. Now you see the most recent item on top. Let us finally look at this top item, Applied Ethics to Issues of Development, Culture, Religion and Education, authored by Obira Ike. By clicking on the thumbnail or the title, this opens the item page with all the bibliographic information and also a link or button to download the full text. And that's it for now. We hope these tips will help you in your search in the globethics.net library. Enjoy!